In this video, I'm going to show you how to make liquid oxygen from the air. To make liquid oxygen from the air, you'll need some kind of pump. You can use a fish air pump, like a fish tank pump, air bubble pump, or you can use like this type of pump here for blowing up um, inflatable pools, that sort of thing. A piece of uh, Tigon tube, a test tube with some wire tied around the top of it to prevent it from sinking under the liquid nitrogen, you'll need a dewer and you'll need to fill that nearly to the top with liquid nitrogen and slowly pump the air through the tube so that it passes um, around the cooled uh, test tube and condenses out the oxygen. Oxygen has a lower boiling point than, actually a higher boiling point than uh, liquid nitrogen so it condenses first. And I've pumped it a few times already, about 20 times, to slow a pumping like this. Let me show you what I've got so far. So basically, here's the liquid oxygen. You can see it connecting in the bottom there. And if you look at it in the right light, it's got a, a faint blue tinge to it. So let's get a little bit more. And what we're gonna do is check it to see if things will burn in it. That's a good way of, of showing that it's liquid oxygen. If things burn brighter in it, then it's very likely to be almost pure. Okay, the first test I'm gonna do with it is to just test its paramagnetism. Liquid oxygen is known to be attracted to magnets weakly because it's weakly, because it's paramagnetic. So. Let's test that. I have a magnet here and as you can see it does not attract liquid nitrogen. Now let's try the same thing with liquid oxygen. See if it can pick up the liquid oxygen. It's a layer of oxygen on there. Let's see if there's any oxygen left. There is actually a bit in there. Again. There it is, sticking to the magnet. Paramagnetism demonstration. Oxygen sticking onto a magnet. Now we're going to see what a piece of burning wood does when put into the tube. It's getting converted completely to CO2 as it burns. Let's turn the lights down so you can see that better. There it goes, really brightly. It's burning intensely hot from the oxygen in the tube. Thanks for watching guys and uh, peace out.